Hello humans, and welcome once again to the weekly shave. Got a bit of a special, special razor. Actually, this one is really special in itself because it is a two blade safety razor. The Savia or Savia, Savia 2 Classic T Razor. T stands for twin, I suppose. It's a Russian military, Soviet military razor made of aluminium and plastic. Black cap here is plastic, rest is aluminium. And a uh, bit of a pain to load the blade because you have to snap one blade and then put it in from each side. And then the second blade, the lowest blade, goes in as normal. So that's a bit frustrating, but get you get used to it. But we'll see. So very light, and the handle has a superb knurling on the handle. Really, really awesome handle. And if, as you can see, you can't see the blades from the sides as you usually can. They're completely sealed and covered. So, I'm thinking this might be a mild razor, and and they designed it to be a mild razor because it's a twin blade. So, but we will see. I only got this yesterday, so I haven't tried it yet. And for the soap, I'm also going to be trying something new. I'm going to be trying to mix two soaps that I've never seen mixed before. I don't know if anyone has ever done this, but I haven't seen it. And I'm gonna mix white parazzo with red parazzo and see how that turns out. So should be should be interesting. All in all with this shave. Should be very interesting. And I'm using my Frank shaving knot synthetic brush and uh, the blades, I forgot to mention the blades, the top blade is a Supermax Blue Diamond and the lower blade is a Rapira Platinum Lux. The Supermax is brand new and the, the Rapira has one use on it already. So. I forgot to bloom the soap this time. So. But I guess we'll have to do without this time. So what I was thinking was I'm actually going to first take a little dab of cream here and put it in. And then I'm going to load the brush with the red presser. And see how that will work. Got an interesting smell already. You can smell both. Both the soaps. So there we go. Nice and peaked. <coughs> A little bit more water, and away we go.
thick, thick cream. So this is either going to be very interesting and fun or not painful, but let's see. Here we go. And the angle is a little bit different because it has a very different head. Head is very different bends. But seems to work great. Right? Doesn't feel aggressive. Fine first pass. take as much off as I as I expected with the two blades but as I said you can't even see the blades so it was designed mild This is a razor that we need to get used to. But it's working. Does leave a lot of leather behind.
And so it's fine. It's not a bad combo. Not a bad combo at all. <laughs> This combo of soap is actually a nice um, winter leather because the white cooling effect is very low. I'll say it's more like a, a fresh feeling, not cold, as it used to. So I'm gonna go. Audio feedback is fine because the, it's made of aluminium. Um, Even though it's mild, it can still cut you. No doubt. And this is this is a razor that could take years to find the sweet spot. Which blades and which blade works at the top position and the lower position and so on and so forth. That could really take a long long time The angle is quite tricky, especially on the neck. You have to keep adjusting your angle. But this razor is at least not for me one that you can just dive into and say, oh, there it is, there's that sweet spot, and just go boop, bada bing, bada boom. But I would definitely say that it's a mild rail. And it's going to take some, some getting used to.
Yeah, people will do it. I think that will do it. And you can still feel the cold from the white terrasso when all the beard is removed. Apart from that little nick there, you won't find. I suspect there will be some irritation in this razor. So. In a league of its own. No doubt about that. But I'm so glad I bought it. It's a very special razor. Woo! Now you can feel the cold from the white terrazzo. Ah! So, bought this one cool little for my Allen block. So, we're gonna see how bad it is. There is something not bad, not bad. But an even amount of steam across the old face. So, but that was to be expected. That was to be expected. But it went far better than my worst fears. So uh. that was fun. Not bad. Not bad at all. Very fun. This combo worked out just fine. Complemented each other. Really good, I thought. Really good. And uh, this bus is uh, softening up a little bit, I think. I should hope. So, so that's it. The Sove Seve Sevier Twin Blade Soviet Army Razor. 
Supermax Diamond, and a pair of Platinum Locks. Very interesting shave, very interesting shave. I'll be making another video of this one with only one blade in the future. I don't know when, but it's going to come. So, got to see what it can do on its own, so to speak. So, that's it. Thank you for watching. Uh, hope you liked the video. Another one next week. And uh, as always, until then, you know what to do.